In Cleveland's Lakefront Stadium, the moment of truth in the American League pennant race, the second-ranking Indians face the White Sox, who will clinch the flag if they win. And their first to score, Louis Aparicio's double sends Bubba Phillips across the plate for the third inning icebreaker. Billy Goodman wraps out another two-bagger to drive in Aparicio and give the pennant-hungry Pale Hose a two-run lead. A rosy outlook for Chicago manager Al Lopez until, in the ninth inning, Cleveland loads the bases on three singles. There's only one out. Time for the White Sox ace troubleshooter. Pitcher Jerry Staley is sent to the mound by Lopez. The Sox first pennant in 40 years hangs in the balance. One pitch ends the suspense, sharp fielding, and the Sox turn it into a double play. The White Sox dance off the field with a 4-2 victory and the pennant in the bag. Their first championship since 1919. It's joyful pandemonium in the dressing room, an exultant conclusion to a season of brilliant play by a team that was low rated earlier as a no-hit club. The White Sox came a long way for this celebration. <laughs>